Hey everyone, Kyle Jason here with another video. So today I want to introduce you guys to a series I'm going to be doing on furnishing your online presence. I'm going to be taking you guys through steps A through Z to getting your first portfolio site online, whether you're a beginner developer or a beginner designer. We're going to start out by making a practice design document as well as some wireframes. Then we're going to take those wireframes into Sketch and we're gonna flesh them out with some color, texture, and things like that. After that, I'm gonna be taking you guys through the steps of hand coding your layout and making it look exactly pixel perfect to the mock-up that we made. I'm even gonna be walking you guys through purchasing a domain and exploring free hosting options. For the purposes of this series, we're gonna actually be using GitHub pages to serve our static site. And then afterwards, I'm gonna talk about some really neat tips and tricks and things that you can use to make the static hosted site a little bit dynamic. Say you wanna update it with new work each time you have a new project to show off. After the series is over, I'm also gonna talk about some other options for people that might not wanna go through the process of making a portfolio site from scratch just yet. So those will be things like Dribble, Behance, Carbon Made, um, GitHub, as well as some other kind of free portfolio site resources that you can take advantage of. So if you guys are excited for that, part one is gonna be talking about drafting a design brief or a basic outline, as well as starting a very basic portfolio site mock-up. And we're gonna talk about some of the elements of that. So subscribe to stick around for those. I'm gonna be releasing these on my normal beginner resources and tutorial day, so Wednesdays. Again, thanks for watching guys. I can't wait to get started and I'll see you guys in the next one. Step design process for beginners. So the first step when you want to get into a very basic design process